Ahem. Gentlemen. Hello, everybody, and welcome to another episode of uh, something that is um, not actually another episode of any continuous series. Um, yeah, so I'm over here posing by the ghost craft thing, and uh, ghost craft is awesome, but that has nothing to do with what we're going to be doing today. And uh, can you take a guess? Can you take a guess of what we're going to be doing today? Okay, I'll give you a hint. It's not this. I honestly have no idea what that is. It is Wasted. Wasted um, recently came out for full users. It was premium for a while, and they have a few premium games set up. Yet, we can actually jump onto games that are not premium, and I always get confused, because the because the queue starts with number 2, and then it goes up. So whenever I want to go to server 2, I accidentally hit server 3, and then I tell people I want server 2. I don't know. Things get crazy. So, um, yeah. And so I'll walk you through how things sort of go as we, um, as we go through this. So I want to choose a server with a fair amount of people so that we can be um, socializing and whatnot. Oh, God. <laughs> okay, that server was full. Was full. Well, let's try to get in again. Hopefully a more successful get in, I guess. Uh, would this work? Do you allow me in? Uh, uh, yes, it does. And now, we still have its own texture pack. And so, if you have a texture pack, this will say C4. And I don't have the official texture pack, but this is the closest thing that I have to the texture pack. And so, it's pretty cool. So, in your inventory, you will have money. I currently have zero dollars, but you can drop in increments of 10, 50, 100, and 500 if you want to share with some friends. This will also show you where the current objective is, because there are objectives in this. This tells you what the slots are about. This is, changes your channel. It, I think it's by default on your team channel, so let me just put it on my team channel. And then this is the slot for... Okay, you know, I'll get to all that in a moment. But yeah, right now we are teamless, so let us choose a team. By default, I usually go Cobra, just because I, I really I really like the Cobra color. It's like, it's diamond colored. It's, it's like a diamond in the sky. I mean, come on. And, um, yeah, I guess you can also get classes, but, you know, I'm not that pro, so I can't really unlock other classes. I don't know how to unlock them. I don't have enough XP. <laughs> so, um, yeah, now that we have our magical blue helmet. Oh, that person's decked out. <laughs> now that we have our magical blue helmet. We can either pick a random spawn or spawn in with some of our teammates who have already secured areas. So let us go... Hmm. I don't know. Let's try spawn 10. Here we go. Uh, oh, that's that's awesome. It just brings up the text on the screen. Oh. Yep. Uh, Pigs are cars. Oh, and that is an enemy. You can see because he has a red name. Luckily he didn't see me because I'm just doing something informational so I'm just going to let him... I, I, I'm gonna let him be. So yeah, these are cars, and by left-clicking them, you can actually see their storage, and by right-click- Oh god. And that is gunfire. I'll get to that in a moment. <laughs> As you can see with our beautiful guns. Pew pew! By the way, if you don't have the texture pack, then, um, uh, it's not actually that big of a problem. Uh, things just don't appear as they would in the texture pack. I mean, it's not actually that bad. I, I started playing Wasted without the texture pack, so... I actually learned what all things did without the texture pack. It, 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 it's easy. It's easy either way. I actually found it harder with the texture pack to believe it or not. But, um, yeah, if they're smoking, that means it's too damaged. So if you left-click it, uh, you can get on and then ride it. So this is your steering wheel. You, you right-click it or just put it in your hand. However, this thing won't move because it's so damaged that it has smoke flying out its butt. All right, yeah, so this here's an actual car. Nothing in it. And uh, we can actually drive this thing around. So the logic behind this is that uh, the XP at the bottom, you may see it right here, that XP uh, tells you like your speed slash damage. So if it's higher than 80, you're going to go really fast. If it's, um, oh sorry, oh man, I almost ran him over. If it's, um, if it's below 80, you know you're going to go significantly slower. And while you're on roads, you move faster. So that's quite interesting. Alright, whoa, look at all this stuff. And so, yes, yeah, slots are dedicated towards things. So, this slot is used for your primary weapon, this slot's used for your secondary, and this slot is for buildings. And so, buildings are pretty cool. So, we have a UMP thingamajigger. <laughs> Do we have any ammo for this? Because to reload weapons, you left click. And so, apparently, I don't have any ammo for it because, you know, the durability shows the ammo, and, and none of this ammo fits what it is. Uh, I, I, it got to me the wrong cartridges. 
Oh, uh, what, what, what did I just say? I don't know what I just said. And, um, uh, okay, that, um, I'm fine, huh? I spend lots of my time just looking through things, seeing if I have the right ammo. So, I think I have the right ammo for this. Let's take a test fire. Right clicking. Boop. Oh, that, that was beautiful. Is this a Remington? Oh, MP5. Derp. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. And then I left click to reload. And, pretty cool. <laughs> and so, the objective is the drop zone. And the, at the drop zone, you know, they will drop chests. It's pretty cool, though. You'll actually see them drop from the sky. It's not like they randomly appear. It's like, huh, these drops, trust me. Not like they actually drop. And, um, why do I always do third person while eating? I feel like I do that often. But, uh, yeah, and then you'll get some supplies from that, whether it's body armor, whether it's jetpacks, whether whether it's more weaponry. It's, it's, it's all pretty cool stuff. So, I'm going to follow this road. Hopefully, it'll lead me in the right direction. Usually roads lead you in a good general direction, so yeah. So I, I trust roads. I trust roads very much. Oh, and there's another pig, just driving by us. <laughs> that that guy's on the team Nightmare. Um, I think it's actually a pretty popular team. Well, it's a pretty popular team for this current server. Uh, for this game, yeah, there's like I think most people are Nightmare, and they also have the most kills if you look at the thing on the on the middle right of my screen. <laughs> Alright, just to let you in on some information, uh, other vehicles you can find are, besides from pigs, you can find cows. Yes, Zem cows. Okay, I'm gonna go off road now. So with Zem cows, uh, they start off with, um, instead of a number down here that says 80, it will start them off with something that says, um, what you might call it, 200. And so, basically they have a lot of thrust. They will they will get you places you need, but the thing about them is that uh, they don't really move as fast. No, wait, what? No, I said that completely wrong. They are harder to drive because um because pigs were actually programmed to do this, so they will like smoothly turn from corners to corners. But because but because the the cow is basically representing a truck, it it has a bit more drift. So if you turn this way, it'll like be a bit more delayed. And you know you have to sort of like plot plan how you're gonna do turns. Turns are a bit more difficult, and so, and also if you find them, just like how this pig is called a car, uh, cows will be called storage trucks because by left clicking them, you have twice as much room to store things inside of them. So it's pretty cool. Oh, just a sneak peek. This is what my screen looks like without the texture pack. <laughs> so that, well, like I'll tell you what, it's actually easier for me to understand what weapons go with what in this in this version. Like, I automatically know that these go into, like, the, like, go into, like, the first pistols, like, that's just grow oh god, turn around, take the fork, <laughs> take the fork! But yeah, I, I automatically know that the 9mm or whatever, the, 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 I know the cocoa beans go into that, and I know the buckshot goes into the, um, the wooden shovel, either, either that or the, no, 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 yeah, it's the wooden shovel. The, the golden shovel is for red dye. But, do I actually have a wooden shovel? No, I don't. Oh, everything is powered off of... Oh, okay, I don't even need the buckshot. <laughs> everything is powered off of my cocoa beans. That's nice. I have all the same ammo. And then, let's trade back over to our wasted texture pack. And here we are. <laughs> and here we are in another town, and... Wow. Imagine if we spawned at this town. This would be quite the lucky place to spawn, because you are only 800 away from the drop zone. And by the way, this ender chest sitting on the ground, this is what your reserve slot is for. The reserve last slot. You can put down buildings. This is a preview of what it is. Left click to cancel and right click to confirm. And then there you go. So there's a whole bunch of different structures that there are in Wasted and this is just one of them. You can also right click them twice to lock them so that if other enemies try to run in and steal them, then you know it's going to be a bit more difficult. So I'm just going to load that structure inside of the car so that I can travel it more easily. Now let's see what this chest over here has. Um, ooh, AK-47. Uh, why not? Why not? <laughs> why not take the AK? Uh, the AK, um, in the default texture pack, um, is a, um, is a stone axe and- OH DANG! YOU JACKING MY CAR! You know, I'm not even gonna- I'm not even gonna chase after him. Uh, somebody from the Team Independence is jacking my car, but whatever. <laughs> But, uh, what was I saying? Yeah, but in the Fall Texture Pack, um, I'm just saying for people who don't have it, the AK is the, um, is the, uh, what do you call it? 
stone axe, and its ammunition is the cyan die. So, yeah. <laughs> these areas right here, these are stores. And so this one isn't occupied, but if you go to different towns, there are some towns that actually have shopkeepers. Um, if there is a shopkeeper, there'll be like a weird like Indian looking guy with the name like paws and paws over his head. And yeah, he can trade you some stuff if you right click him. And if you don't trade him some stuff, then he'll get angry at you. Oh, and by the way, you can break melons. Woohoo! <laughs> well, they don't stack, so that's rather disappointing. But yeah, come on, to the drop zone! And what I find interesting about the drop zone is that because it's like placed in a center location and all compasses point in towards that location, it's, it's like this block right here is the drop zone. Point that way, it'll point that way, it'll point that way, it'll point that way. Well, like, obviously, right? So, like, once you're there, you know that everybody has exact coordinates to where you are. Exact coordinates. So they can, like, find you, like, while you're in possession of the drop zone. Alright, 400 blocks away. Gonna nom on some more rations, as they're called. Gonna head along with my AK-47. Look out! I got an AK! Uh, yeah. And then some weapons are also scoped. If you have a scoped weapon, uh, then right next to it, um, It'll say in parentheses scoped, and once you are, and once you do have a scope weapon, you can actually shift, and then that'll zoom in your point of view. Like it'll zoom in your field view, and it'll also improve your accuracy. So that's what the scoping does. It's pretty cool, <laughs> but I don't have any scoped weapons, so I can't really show you. <laughs> All right, and once we come across the drop zone, the drop zone is a giant beacon. All right, you got to me. We're only a hundred blocks away, so we'll be seeing it any second now. 100 blocks goes by fast. <laughs> oh my god, wobble jump! Well, oh, wobble sprint. <laughs> I like to call it, like, spastic. Spastic sprint, yeah. Alright, there we go. Look, and look at all these buildings. You see, these are all buildings that you can that you can set up by yourself. These are all buildings that you can build. Like, like they put down ender chests and they built those. All those over there are enemies. They don't see me yet. Oh, maybe they do. I don't know. My, 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 my giant... Cyan head is probably very visible out of this crowd. Okay, they they notice me. Shift to increase accuracy. We're in war. This is war. Oh, okay, he's running. I think he's going to get his friends. <laughs> so while he's doing that, let me run around the side. Another enemy over there. And so yeah, these are all structures that you can build yourself. And usually they'll build it around the around the drop zone or around the beacon. Oh my God, look at that guy. Look at that guy flying so high. He has a jetpack. Either that or he's a hacker. <laughs> okay, well, vine, vine tower. This is new. Oh, I've never seen a vine tower before. Cool, that's a vine tower. <laughs> All right, there he is again. AK-47. <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> well, that was. He got a headshot on me. That that was quite interesting. I usually shoot for the stomach, so I'm not all that good. But yeah, you get the point. So there's a beacon at the drop zone, and I wonder what team had possession of it. I I don't know. Oh, Nightmare. Of course, Nightmare. You, you little rascals. And by the way, if, if you think, oh, Nightmare's winning, I'm going to change over to their team. Nope, can't switch servers until the next game. Just thought I'd you know that. And this brings you to this random spot in. Wasted, just because it's been very popular, there's been lots of people joining it, and I think it's actually pretty interesting. So, shoot your bullets in the air. Pew, 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 And then run out of ammo on that clip. Oh my goodness, what is this? <laughs> I'm also very new to, um, to Wasted. So, you're going to see me getting, like, flabbergasted at that point. Is this a movable structure? It looks like it is, because it's put out, like, in the middle of nowhere. All right. <laughs> well, yeah, I guess we'll conclude with this ominous structure that I have no idea how it got here. So everybody, thanks for watching, and I shall hope to see you next time. Oh, looks like somebody got a kill streak. Okay, and goodbye. And 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 stop recording. Oh dang! You jacking my car!